everyone, welcome back to my channel. So what will a sex therapist do is a common question I get a lot. So that depends. A, if we are assessing and treating a specific DSM-5 diagnosis, then we will be doing some things to treat those symptoms, right? Be that, for example, if there's rec erectile functioning struggles or issues or problems or anything like that, we might look into medication. We may look into external referral sources to be able to help get maybe like a thyroid test done or some different things here, right? If that is more mental, like mental, there's more stressors, anxiety, maybe depression, some other things going on, we might do some different types of sex therapy exercises. For example, if there's performance anxiety with erectile functioning struggles, we may need to do some self-soothing exercises, be able to do our own foreplay first before with a partner. Slow the fuck down, chill the fuck out, and do some other things. We have to practice how we play. So we will talk through strategy, a game plan, role play, and even like think through what are some things that might be good for you to do. And when I say role play, I say like picture the scene, what's going to happen, what's going to help you soothe your anxiety, calm you down before you go and engage in foreplay with yourself, but also partner, spouse, whoever it might be, right? Um, your relationship, right? <laughs> your situationship, whatever it might be. So essentially that is a piece of it. We look at physical, we look at mental. Some other components here too, sex therapists will also give different types of sex therapy exercises. Um, this could be so many different ones. If you wanna be able to check out my sexual self-care oracle card deck, that's literally all these different types of sex exercises that you can do for yourself. And they're really helpful for people in sex therapy. An example might be, you know, mirror masturbation, masturbating and looking at your genitals in front of the mirror. So that way you gain data and you understand a little bit more about what is my body like? How can I communicate this with to a partner in the future? And what motions am I doing so that I can know and share that information, right? Another example might be body care. It might be shaving. It might be putting on makeup. It might be doing something to make you feel confident, wearing a sexy outfit, right? Um, when we boost our confidence, we feel sexier. We feel good at the end of the day. Other people are like holy shit I'm attracted to you like your energy's awesome I fucking love you right people see that they pick up on that confidence is the number one key trait that we look for in friends family people ourselves and especially partners or spouses yeah tell me what you think of that in the comments below did you know that I don't know um some other types of sex exercises that we might do is we may explore different types of sex positions you may explore different types of sex toys that you find pleasurable lubes um of course outside a session I do education on this. I don't watch people do this in session, right? Um, we may explore some different types of things with uh, turn-ons, turn-offs, your body as an erogenous zone, um, it may be scheduling sex, it may be journaling and writing out your sexual fantasies, it may be doing some things with like yes, no, maybe checklists, it may be doing some other pieces of really focusing on pleasure, aphrodisiacs, things that get you hot and going, right? So there are a lot of different types of sex therapy exercises that sex therapists will use um, and incorporate in tools and interventions in session for also clients to use outside a section, a session, section. <laughs> it may be more so homework assignments. I don't like the word homework. Do y'all like the word homework? I don't. I call it like personal growth exercises. Personally, that's just me. You do you. If y'all like homework, you're like, yes, I love it. Woo. Cool. Me, not so much, but <laughs> you do you at the end of the day. That is what, uh, those are some things about what sex therapists do. Some different types of sex therapy exercises. Tell me in the comments below what questions you may have over all about this um and make sure you like share subscribe if this video was helpful send it to a friend thanks so much for being here stay tuned for more and stay shameless